Hi, today's July 30th. I'm Mark Friedman. I'm just an American citizen, but always proud to be one. Uh, we're going to talk, uh, no notes, no sense, because we're going to talk about two things today in this one. It's a dummy of the week. who's Susan Ferecchio, I think, of the National Examiner or whatever, some newspaper in the Washington Examiner, I'm sorry, I think. And then, of course, Herman Cain just died. And we're going to call it Herman Cain died another Trump casualty. Yeah, it's Donald Trump's fault. Herman Cain was a person who brought himself up from very modest background and became incredibly successful. A successful business person, a successful family person, it appeared, and happy and ran for president. I wasn't a supporter of his, didn't agree with most of his positions, but had to respect a man like that. It really is part of the American dream. I mean, he just kind of made it happen. And at the same time, okay, so then he, what he did was, he's a major supporter of Trump, and Trump, as you remember, had his super spreader tour. We talked about those, and he went down to uh, uh, Arizona and had his supporters, Trump, come out and support, of course, had no masks. Herman Cain didn't have a mask. Herman Cain was a cancer survivor. But Trump supporters can't wear masks because the president doesn't believe in masks. He gives you some BS once or twice, and then he runs out, puts, then he runs out, and of course doesn't wear it, and tells everybody you can do what you want to do. But you have the same thing going on. So he goes in, Herman Cain goes into the hospital, is sick. Everybody says he'll be okay. You hope he is. Then yesterday, on Brett Baer on Fox News, you get Susan Ferecchio saying, "I'm going to read this. I'm going to quote it. It's not a note. Quote: The whole theory behind masks is debatable." End quote. Well, really. Herman Cain didn't wear a mask. Herman Cain's dead. Now, could Herman Cain have died with the mask? Of course. But unlike Louis Gohmert, another dummy, who said that if you move your mask around, you can move the, the virus into the mask, which goes up to your nose and makes you sick. Where are these people coming from? You gotta wear a mask. You gotta wear a mask. This is all Trump's fault. He says nothing's wrong. Do you ever hear him talk about the 150,000 people that are dead? 150,000 Americans dead in the President of the United States can't say one thing about it. We'll see what he says about his friend. We'll see what these people like Susan Ferecchio say. They got every excuse in the world to come up with stuff. Let's remember, didn't your mommy and daddy teach you? If you cough, you put your hand in front of your face. Now it's your elbow. If you, if you sneeze, you put your hand in front of your face. I like to take people like Susan Ferecchio and Donald Trump and stick them in the middle of sick people and let them sneeze and cough on them without masks and see how well they do two weeks later. This is sad. Another death. Thank you, Donald Trump. This country will make it, though. We'll make it past this guy. Peace.